it's Nicole, and today we are talking about shacking up. Okay, not really. But what to do when you do shack up with your significant other or your friend, or if you're just doing a little spring cleaning. We are gonna discuss some ways to make some money while getting rid of your shoes. All right, so I hear you. It's really tough to get rid of your stuff, but a good baby step might be when you see something you have two of, let's say you're cohabitating, you see you have two dustbusters. My friend, you are never ever going to need two dustbusters. So why don't you rent one out? Rentoid, Snap Goods, both good sites. This is basically where you post what you have to rent out. A renter puts a security deposit on PayPal. You guys figure out how to make your trade and then you get like 10 to 15 bucks depending on what the item is. So when it comes to selling your furniture, Classified ads, let's be serious, are quasi sketchy and very annoying. So you might wanna look for a furniture warehouse. That's where they will pick up, in most cases, your furniture, take it to their warehouse, sell it themselves, give you 60 to 70% of what they sell it for, give them 30 to 40%, but you always wanna negotiate. Sure, you might make some more money if you sell this puppy on your own, but you won't have the headache and you will get rid of it. Hallelujah. So you can sell your stuff. I'm not going to stop you. Yes, you can go to Craigslist. I'm not here to give you breaking news. This is not 2000 that Craigslist exists. Um, but a couple of little insider tricks. You wanna post your stuff on Craigslist on the first or the 15th of the month because that's when most folks are moving in or moving out. That makes sense. Those are peak times. You also wanna make sure to get cash from the buyer because you do not want to be left with a bounce track in there, sister. Another good way to make some extra cash is by going shopping in your own closet. You can sell your stuff at uh, national chains like Plato's Closet and Crossroads. Regionally, I love Wasteland in Los Angeles and in San Francisco and Beacon's Closet in New York City. Just a little pro tip, if you're going in with some nicer dresses uh, or work clothes, put them on a hanger. You'll likely get more money for them and you can also get rid of some, I mean seriously random stuff.